my name is uh, Dr. Wanjiko. Oh, now in Lodwa or in Trukala, known as Nanyait. Uh, I'm the proprietor of the Cradle Tented Camp, uh, which is uh, situated in Lodwa, the capital city of uh, Trukana County. Oh, we were the first to have this kind of uh, hotel, which has this kind of ambience with the grass. Also the pool that uh, we have done, that was the first pool here at the Cradle. When we started, uh, the fastest uh, accommodation that we'd have come up with is the tented camps. These are self-contained tents with AC and um, it's the only tented camp in Lodwa. We've done uh, very well with the tents. That's what we started. We have 16 tents. Then we also have uh, the stone build. Uh, block, uh, maybe say kind of apartments or accommodation. So we have um, another 16 of that and uh, that gives us a, a total of 32 rooms. Lodwa or Trukana County has been known to have a lot of business travelers because we have a lot of NGOs. We have more than 30 NGOs working with the county. Where are the conferences? Where do they take their conferences? Where are they accommodated? People want quality and they want value for for their money. If you pay something, if you're paying uh, some money, then you'd want to get value. That was what was lacking and this is what we have brought now, that we give you a five-star experience in terms of, uh, of hospitality and what you'd be expecting. The food that we give to our clients, we usually airlift because not all vegetables are grown here, so we have to airlift some of them. The transport, uh, the cost of air freight is 200 uh, shillings per kg. So, but this is just to make sure that we give our clients quality food. There's nothing that you'd want in the menu. If you had the, the same menus that you get in Nairobi, you'd get the same here. My name is uh, Antonio Chien. I'm the sales and marketing manager of the Cradle Tented Camp and Lodge. It's a very unique lodge because it is both a tented camp and it, it, it also has a lodge wing. By lodge, I mean uh, the building was, is built with chick blocks and uh, the other bit is basically the tent similar to the ones in Masai Mara. If you want packages for bird watching, you can get a two nights package. If you want packages for adventure to the lake, you can get a three days, two nights package. We can also get um, a three nights, four days package which includes a visit to the Turkana Boy and also Turkana Basin Institute. One thing that stands out about this uh, facility is in terms of security, we are fully secured. Then in terms of space, we can take a very big group at any time, any given day. In terms of our service, we stand out. We are one of the best facilities uh, in the North Rift who have hosted the VVIPs who come into the circuit and also the country. I'm Willem Kamani and I live in Boston, Massachusetts. I expected to come and see a dry, arid little lake, but in reality it was massive, massive, massive with uh, the Crater Island, is it called, in the center of the lake and on the side of the lake you can kind of see the dunes and the trees. It was looking very beautiful and the swimming in Lake Trukana is really nice. You have not completed Kenya without visiting Turkana, is what I tell the tourists. I think it needs to be added to the list of to-dos in Kenya. It's not the place that you need to avoid, it's the place that you need to come to. This is where the fun is. This is where the action is.